Maybe a bit better view now. What what's going on? Serious crash. Well guys, this is um, the after crash um, video. <laughs> this um, propeller uh, jumped off the, the motor during the crash. Um, yeah, as you can see it's well broken. Um, that's the good thing of having perhaps this, uh, this type of uh, interface, this attachment to the motors are not really screw rather than um, press when you screw the top cone this inner there is a conical um, uh, male and female shape on the external uh, piece and the, the internal one which means that uh, when you screw this the inner part presses onto the shaft so far, well, it's obviously better than the prop savers, and it I think that actually might be even better um, if you can expect some crashes because um, yeah, the prop can just jump if uh, instead of bending the shaft when there is a hard crash and the prop is hitting something, and if it was uh, screw into the shaft, yeah. The, um, I would have bent it probably. Doesn't seem bent at all, actually. Another prop also broke. It hit the, the wood of the terrace.
but the rest yeah seem 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 okay maybe i will i will anyway change all four for uh, new uh, balanced uh, props and the two that are fine i will keep them as a spare or check them later on they might be bent so the angle can be different now so i'm not sure that after a crash like i had um, it's wise to just assume that the, those are fine as well they, it could be bent and then it would be um, yeah, an asymmetric uh, lift in any blade any of the half blades but the rest is fine the antenna which as you see it's secure that it cannot rotate otherwise it would hit the props that's very dangerous hmm? so it's not really able to rotate you just go forward in this case maybe next time I will keep it a bit like that because if it flips I prefer that are the shafts with the props and that the antenna can bend instead of like it was now it was completely vertical so the first thing it touches but it didn't damage this crash was pretty tough actually it essentially fell down from um, I would say four meters almost vertically so the thing is that these provisional legs that I have here which actually are secured but they allow some displacement and in the way that I put the zip ties they act like a spring like um, they have some spring like uh, effect so they obviously they damp quite a lot they, this probably absorbed a lot of energy but what happened is that it fell down kind of vertical from 3-4 meters I didn't control the throttle properly in this maneuver so essentially it hit the ground pretty, pretty hard and then it flipped the propellers were still rotating um, so that's why when they hit the, the terrace floor uh, wood uh, some of them uh, broke um, yeah I, I'm not sure how actually this um, uh, could this propeller could li leave the, the motor shaft actually because in principle this means that uh, there was some force from below which I have uh, I don't recall it but anyway I'm not yeah so interested on knowing the rest seems fine hopefully the IPM and the GPS and so on uh, didn't suffer any damage due to the 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 impact the collision nothing collided with them uh, directly but um, yeah but um, anyway the IPM is pretty damped and so on so I'm not really worried the rest seems fine the cables are fine and yeah so some work to fix a few things and um, continue trying things on this uh, APM 2.6 uh, quadcopter thanks for watching if you like the these videos remember thumbs up